someone has reported you and you need to pray. The thing is this, just try to picture it like this. That is why in everything you need to pray. I know that at times you might think that, ah, oh, hey, I can't pray about this to, to God. No, 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 no. You know what it does when you pray about everything? We are not serving a dead God. We are not serving a cybotic God that is programmed to answer prayers. He reasons like if you can just talk to your parent and say, mom, can you buy me this or dad? Can you get me this? So and so, can you get me this? That is our God. You get what I'm saying? So that is why if you are to make your request known unto the Lord, he will decide whether to grant or to decline. He won't harm you. He won't hurt you. He won't beat you up. But that is why it is important. By default, you can also know that, hey, but such a thing, I cannot ask from my mom. I cannot say, hey, you get what I'm saying? That is why there are some things we cannot pray about. But the bottom line is, you ought to pray always. You ought to check each and everything. That is why you be in a position where somebody has reported you. Somebody has gotten in your way. And no wonder why your things were stuck. No wonder why this person has been changing their attitude. No wonder why your spouse left you. No wonder why that person engaged you and they never went on with the process. No wonder why they called you, but then... And the last minute, they took your fingerprint for that employment, but you don't know what happened. They no longer contacted you. Something happened. Those are the things that you need to pray about. The Lord has made it a rule or a law. We pray, we get answered. That is why there are some things that can make no mistake about it. As much as there are things that when you ask, okay, there are things which you don't ask, he will grant you, though you did not pray for, there are things that he will not give you until you ask first. Just picture it like a child. You have your child or you as a child, even if you're not a parent. But there are things that when you require or a child requires from a parent, the parent will buy because the child requested. Whereas there are also things that a parent will just go, for example, to the mall and they just come back with something that the child never asked for. And they'll be like, hey, I brought you some na 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 na. And the child will be, hey, thanks. You get what I'm saying? So it's something like that. Even unto the Lord. That is why he says, we must also ask. He will give you your heart's desires. There are things that you will look at your child. And they can see that you are interested with stuff like this. And they'll be like, one day we're going to surprise you. And you never ask, but you get. Your child never asks, but you give. And there are things that your child will beg you to buy them. And you, you were not seeing value. But just because it's a why not type of thing, you grant unto them. Let me tell you likewise, you ought to pray always. They are doing things against you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I also want to pray. I declare, I declare anywhere where they have stood in your way. They have been trying to sabotage you. They have been bad-mouthing you. Let the Lord come in your defense. Whichever way suitable may, but may the Lord defend you and restore all that was stolen from you. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. And you can also book an appointment with me. Others are booking and what are you waiting for? My details on the comment section below and I will see you next time.